All right, this will be how you can transfer your contacts and data from your Moto G7 Play to your other device. So first of all, we're gonna swipe up. We're gonna locate the Contacts app here. And when you first open it up, it'll look like this. You'll see a list of your contacts. Hit these three lines here at the top, hit Settings. And we have accounts here. So if you tap accounts and this is toggled on as it is here and you hit add account, you can link this with a Google account, Lenovo ID, do a preview or something like one of these options. Um, and then if you sign into one of these on your other device, it will automatically sync all of that contact data across. The other way will be on your new device. If you have your contact saved to your SIM card would be to go here to manage contacts, import, and select SIM card, and it'll transfer all those saved contacts to your new device. Now let's look at storage. So we would swipe up and we will locate our uh, files here. Oh, I'll go back to show that, which is right here. This is Google Files. And when you first open it up, it'll probably be in the browse menu. So here we can kind of see all of the different types of files we will have on the device, so videos, audio, etc. If we tap internal storage, we can actually see all of the folders as well. But all we really have to do here is have files uh, app on this device and the Google Files app on your new device as well. Then you'll go to share. And on this device, you would tap send. And from send, you'd be able to select the uh, different files you would want to transfer over and on your new device you would tap receive. This will allow you to easily transfer all this data across your devices pretty painlessly. Um, another option would be to go to the Play Store. I don't have an account set up on this phone, um, but you could search in the Play Store also for data transfer and you could look at the different apps that exist there as well. So a pretty popular one is Zapia, but there's some other ones that are pretty reputable as well. Ideally, I would select something with at least four star rating and some pretty good reviews.